Welcome to Janet's Planet, where we're traveling at the speed of thought. Did you know that between 1942 and 1944, over 1,000 women left their homes and their jobs for the opportunity of a lifetime to become the first in history to fly for the United States military? Cornelia Fort's adventure took her away from home to Hawaii as a flight instructor. She was in flight the morning of the attack on Pearl Harbor. She and her student pilot narrowly escaped. Cornelia returned home and anxiously anticipated a call to duty. When the Army announced that for the first time they would accept female pilots to take part in the new Women's Auxiliary Ferrying Squadron, Cornelia was the second in line to volunteer. I'm gonna fly. Cornelia, along with these other female pilots, transported planes from manufacturing plants to U.S. military bases around the country, freeing up male pilots to fight in the war. Cornelia wrote these words for an article in the Nashville Banner. I, for one, am profoundly grateful that my one talent, my only knowledge, flying, happens to be of use to my country when it's needed. That's all the luck I ever hope to have. On March 21, 1943, Cornelia Fort was killed when the plane she was piloting across Texas collided with another military aircraft. Let your mind revolve around this thought. Life is either a daring adventure or nothing at all. And that's the view from Janet's planet. Janet's planet!